Hello YouTube, I'm going to do a quick video reviewing a portable power bank. Uh, this is made by Intoval. And uh, full disclosure, they sent this to me to try out and make a video, but it's not a, not a paid review or anything. They just sent me the product to try. And I've already had it out of the box here. It came uh, dead, so I had to charge it up. And I have uh, messed around with it just a little bit to familiarize myself with it. Uh, we'll go ahead and we'll uh, unbox it and show you what all comes in the box. And then show you the uh, kind of cool features that I like. And mention one thing that I uh, think could be an improvement on it. But we'll get to the end here. So in the box, got a user manual. The device itself. And I really like the size of it. And it also has a USB cable here to uh, actually charge the actual unit. Get that stuff out of the way here. Now one really cool thing about this is if you have an Apple Watch or a smart watch, this actually supports wireless charging. And I'll put the uh, pictures up on the screen here so you can check that out. Because I, I don't actually wear a watch. I don't have one. But uh, you can just set your watch on this to charge it. Another cool thing here is it's got a built-in USB-C plug. And they have another version too that's got a, a, a Apple Lightning Cable plug. And there will be a link in the description. You can click that and both, uh, both versions are there if you want to check it out. And... Um, I'm also a uh, content creator here, so I, you know, I carry a GoPro uh, pretty much everywhere I go. And since I have the USB-C version, I can actually charge my GoPro or my GoPro batteries. And um, also, it, it does have on it, too, it's got a USB-C plug here and a lightning port here. So you can plug a lightning cable in and then plug in an iPhone or an older iPhone anyway. And uh, one thing I do wish it had, though, was a USB-A plug. It does not have that. That's the one thing I would change on this. But overall, though, I think you know, it is a good unit, and all of my, my devices are are pretty much uh, all USB-C, uh, except an old iPod I have, but don't really use that a whole lot. But I'm going to uh, plug this into my GoPro here. Hit the button, power it up. And see the red light comes on, indicating that it is actually charging it, and uh, you know it will charge the GoPro, which... Uh, it helps you know when you're out there filming, and uh, it will also charge my uh, GoPro spare batteries. You see the lights light up on that and charge those. And um, well, just the main thing I would use it for is actually cell phones. Uh, I carry around two iPhone 15s, and sometimes I need to charge them. This one is almost dead here. It's at 6%. And you notice here we've got the uh, charger plugged in, and it's actually starting to charge. And so things I do like about this, I like the size of it. Uh, it's you know very portable, uh, very lightweight, and uh, it will actually charge the phone to 50% uh, fairly quick, um, which is you know it's good if you're traveling or out in the field. And I guess I really don't have a whole lot else to say about it. There's not really much else to it. I mean, you know, it's a power bank that's supposed to charge stuff, and uh, it does a very good job of it. And like I mentioned before, the only thing I would change is I would just I would just put a USB-A or a full-size USB plug on it. It would be the one thing I would change about it. Uh, if you want more information, though, click the link in the description. Check it out. If you have any uh, questions or comments or thoughts or anything on this, I'll, I'll leave a comment for me. I, I tend to answer everything. And uh, until next time, we'll uh, talk to everybody later.